it's somewhere in the neighborhood of about two for three when he subs in for Matt Rohde. Judy and Vixmer, butts and plots. Huh, butts and plots. There's the one to go. Puts Brett Van Horn on the outside of Mickey Shelley in that third row with Jacob Boldig right behind too. Like we said, a lot on the line for those two. They'll try to find their way through. We're back to green. Vix back to second as Shooty gets away. Then we're side by side for third. Plutz on the outside of Chad Butts. Plutz gonna get the run into the third spot. Gonna be Van Horn on the outside. Jacob Bolding as well. Brett Van Horn looks like he's gonna seal up that championship. He'd like to do it with a win. And here comes Jacob Bolding to the inside. It is Van Horn to the outside. They move to fourth and fifth, respectively. Put Brett Van Horn up to fourth. Seven gone this time for Don Shooty and the gang. We're watching Brett Van Horn close that gap on Jason Plutz. He is right there on the tailgate, taking a peek to the high side. Plutz giving him plenty of room to the high side, but it looks like Van Horn might want to go low this time. They'll go into three and four again. Will there be something there for Van Horn to take? Plutz slides up. Here comes Van Horn to the inside. Brett Van Horn now low to the third spot. Jacob Boldig might follow in the 77. Boldig now to fourth. Now that duo Van Horn and Boldig will set their sights on the five of Brian Vixmer. It'll be a long way to go to catch up to Todd Shooty. They gotta get there first. A truck leg separates second and third. Brett Van Horn down on the inside. A little bubble that time by Vixmer, it might be enough. Here comes Brett Van Horn down on the bottom. Vixmer turns him away for now. Brett Van Horn trying to make that run into three and four. Side by side into the turn. Justin Fickle in the 47 is slowed in front of your leaders. Tanner Fickle in danger of going a lap down and he will. Shooty puts him a lap down as he comes across the stripe with 11 to go. Now Shooty stuck in lap traffic. Van Horn on the inside gonna take the second spot away. Bowling's up to third. Vixmer has fallen back to four. Fickle gets around Chesky. There is Brett Van Horn trying to work his way through. Now nothing but clean air between him and the leader, Todd Shooty, but a lot of clean air is sitting there. Jacob Bolding also going to get around Fickle. He's in third, he's trying to keep pace with Brett Van Horn, who's working to close in on the leader with eight to go. Van Horn trying to chop away. Thus far, we haven't seen a champion take a checkered flag. Van Horn trying to buck the trend. Slowly gaining on Todd Shooty here in the final laps of this one. Shooty just shot up the track a little bit in three and four. That allows Van Horn to close a little bit more. 
Van Orn slowly reeling in. Don Schutte up front. Chopping away, chopping away, chopping away. Time ticking though. Lap 25 to go. Van Horn is right within striking distance now. They'll race into three and four, putting Camley in a lap down. Todd Schutte across the line, four to go. Van Horn there and starting to look around. Picked up high, ducks it low. Now within a truck length. Meanwhile, back out of the second turn, Vixmer's gotten around Bolding. So put Vixmer back to third. Trouble for Tanner, Tanner Fickle, he will pull it into the X. Here comes Van Horn, look at top side as they close in on the left truck of Mike Berg. Side by side, Van Horn gonna have to try to go through the five hole here. Not a lot of room, Berg keeps it up top. Van Horn trying to slide through, making some contact with Shooty. It'll be a lap and a half to go down the back stretch. Shooty trying to hold off Van Horn. He backs up the turn, slides into the inside as the white flag comes out. Here comes Brett Van Horn to the inside. Door to door with Shooty and Van Horn gets away. Down the back stretch, one chance for Shooty to get the rebuttal. He won't. Brett Van Horn a win in a championship. Shooty second, third to Vixmer, fourth to Bolding, and Jason Plutz rounds out the top five. This one is certainly going to be very meaningful. We mentioned this is what they have dubbed the Bruce's 100. In honor of Bruce Boldig and Bruce Van Horn and how fitting that one of the two drivers will take the checkered flag. We're gonna do the same thing we did for the heavy metal challenge. Drivers are gonna be coming down here as Brett Van Horn is gonna take that checkered flag for the Polish victory lap. Winning a championship, he'll come roll the die. Extra hundred bucks on the line, courtesy of Team Van Horn and Team Boldig. So Brett Van Horn effectively sweeps the season. He wins the red, white, and blue championship in the Wisconsin Sport Trucks. Wins his second straight title, and he's gonna salute the blue shirts over in turns one and two. Brett Van Horn and takes the final checkered flag of 2014 for the Wisconsin Sport Trucks. Laura Leach with your winner and your chip. Brett Van Horn down here in Victory Lane. What a season for this guy. I know this win's gonna be in the locker room. Getting all the safety equipment off. There comes the gearbox.
can't take my sponsors enough for everything they do. WDSC Motorsports, Mike Queen and Bill, are really, really good motor. John Rayson was an awesome 